वेलकम बैक प्रॉब्लम सेवन डैश एटीन सो स्टेटमेंट इज इफ वाइट फ्लैन बीम इज सब्जेक्टेड टू शेयर ऑफ थर्टी किलो न्यूटन डिटरमाइन द मैक्सिमम शेयर स्ट्रेस इन द बीम सेट डब्ल्यू इज इक्वल टू टू हंड्रेड मिलीमीटर सो यू कैन सी दिस इज द वाइट फ्लैन बीम दैट इज एक्टेड अपॉन बाई शेयर फोर्स ऑफ थर्टी किलो न्यूटन एंड दिस डब्ल्यू इज गिवन एज टू हंड्रेड मिलीमीटर सो अबाउ वेट एंड बिलो वेट इज नाउ इक्वल सो यू हैव टू फाइंड द मैक्सिमम शेयर स्ट्रेस इन द बीम सो लेट स्टार्ट विद द सोल्यूशन सो एज वी नो दैट मैक्सिमम शेयरिंग स्ट्रेस इज इक्वल टू वी इंटू क्यू डिवाइड बाई आई इंटू टी सो हेयर वी हैव दिस वी दैट इज थर्टी किलो न्यूटन वी डू नाट हैव क्यू वी डू नाट हैव आई एंड टी इज ऑल्सो देयर दैट इज ट्वेंटी फाइव मिलीमीटर सो वी विल फर्स्ट फाइंड section property that is i so for that i have to draw this beam and when we draw this beam and uh, let me draw it first so this is the beam this width which is given as 200 mm so in term of meter it is equal to 0.20 meter this thickness is given as 25 mm which is 0.025 meter this thickness of this top flange is given as 30 mm which is 0.03 meter similarly this height from height of the web is given as uh, 2250 mm and that is 0.25 meter and this thickness of lower flange is 0.03 meter now if i draw the neutral axis so neutral axis will be the in the mid that is mid of uh, 0.25 so now we will find the moment of inertia so first we will find the moment of inertia of this whole rectangular piece so its width is 0.20 and total height is 0.310 i will also write it the total height is 0.310 meter now we know that i is equal to 1 over 12 bh cube so 1 over 12 breadth is 0.20 and height is 0.310 whole cube clear and we will subtract minus 2 times this the moment of inertia of this portion because this and this portion are same so i will find the moment of inertia of this one portion and multiply it with 2 so if this width is you can see this is equal to 0.20 minus 0.025 divided by 2 and this width is again this width is given as if you calculate it will be 0.0875 meter so minus 2 times 1 over 12 width is 0.0875 and height is this 0.25 whole cube so when you solve this you will get the moment of inertia of this uh, shaded i or red white flange beam and that comes out to be 268.652 into 10 to the power minus 6 meter power 4 now you have this i as well clear so we will find this q and this q we know that q is equal to sum of y dash into a so this area which is about the neutral axis so this is the portion so you can see your you have two portion one is this one um uh, this one one is this one and other is this one so what we will do is that we will first find the area of this uh, first one which is 0.025 uh sorry uh, q is yes 0. 
I will write. So first is this one. You can see this height is this height is equal to 0 0.25 divided by 2, which is equal to uh, 0 0.252, which is equal to 0 0.125 meter. So I will write its area is 0 0.125 multiply by its width is 0 0.025 and y dash is uh, its distance from neutral axis till mid so this is y dash and this y dash is equal to 0 0.125 divided by 2 which is equal to 0 0.0625 plus we will now come to this second one so you can see area is 0 0.02 into 0 0.03 so 0 0.20 into 0 0.03 and what will be y dash so y dash is distance from neutral axis till mid and this is this is y1 dash and this is y2 dash and this y2 dash you can see this is equal to 0 0.125 plus half of this 0 0.03 which is 0 0.015 so both of this sum will give you uh, sum of this plus this will give you 0 0.140 okay so when you solve this you will get q is equal to 1.0353 into 10 to the power minus 3 cubic meter now you have all the values you can just put tau max is equal to v into q divided by i into T. so v is given as in question it is given as 30 kilo newton so 30 into 10 to power 3 q is 1.0353 into 10 to power minus 3 divided by i is 268.652 into 10 to power minus 6 and thickness is the thickness of this web which is 0 0.025 0 0.025 so when you solve this you will get the maximum sharing stress comes out to be 4.62 mega pascal and this is the answer of our this question so this was all about problem 7.18 i hope you have enjoyed this video those who are new to my channel then subscribe it and press the bell icon so that you can get notification about latest video if you have any question you can ask me in comment section thank you for watching